Hi, it's Dr. Bishop from Animal Healthcare. I'm going to talk to you about Lyme disease today. Lyme disease is, of course, a disease that's transmitted by ticks to dogs. It's one of a half a dozen or so diseases that are transmitted to dogs by ticks. Um, in the state of Illinois, the incidence of heartworm disease is only 20% the incidence of Lyme disease. In other words, Lyme disease is five times as common according to testing done by Antec Laboratories and IDEX Laboratories, which are national labs that collect samples from veterinarians throughout the state of Illinois. So Lyme disease is a big player, but the bigger issue is, is that we have a disease called ehrlichiosis that's also more common according to Antex and IDEX studies and anaplasmosis, which is more common, again, than heartworm, uh, according to Antex and IDEX studies. So we can vaccinate against Lyme disease, but the uh, probably more important thing, because we have six or so tick-transmitted diseases that affect dogs, including Rocky Mountain Spotted Fever and the three previously mentioned ones, uh, tularemia is another one, um, and there, there are others, but there's a bunch of tick transmitted diseases that we can't vaccinate for. The only one we can vaccinate for is Lyme disease. So the initial prevention, in my opinion, for Lyme disease is 12 out of 12 month flea and tick preventative. Now, not all flea and tick preventatives will block the bite of the tick from transmitting the disease. So feel free to give us a call and we can explain to you the ones that we recommend. Um, some that are touted as three month or 12 week and when you dig into them further are only good for eight months or eight weeks, I'm sorry, not eight months. Um, so um, again, give us a call if you're wondering which ones are the good ones. If the budget allows for a Lyme vaccine and your dog goes outside and lives in Northern Illinois or Southern Wisconsin, um, you certainly, certainly should consider doing a Lyme vaccine because it's a fairly common disease that's out there. The vaccine needs to be given twice in the initial, uh, initial time and then once a year thereafter and the patient needs to be, the puppy needs to be a certain age in weeks and then a certain number of weeks later given the second vaccine. So if you have questions, feel free to give us a call here at Animal Health Care. Our number is 630-305-7200. Again, 630-305-7200. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.